What's up guys, this is Zach Hample and the pressure is on today. I normally don't start my stadium videos from a car, but this is the situation. My flight today from New York to Texas got delayed four hours. And as a result, I completely missed batting practice. Now, a lot of you guys know, oh man, that sun is right in my face. So a lot of you guys know that I have a huge consecutive game streak in the works. I've gotten at least one ball at every single game for more than 25 years, 1,494 consecutive games with a ball. So I have to find a way to get one today. The Rangers are using commemorative baseballs for the final season at Globe Life Park. So extra motivation. The Angels are here. Mike Trout is here. He just missed a few games with a minor groin injury. He's back in the lineup. I have tickets in two different spots, center field and the third base dugout. I want to increase my chances, go for home runs, go for third out balls. Hey, do it in the back seat, show your face. That is Ian, my new videographer. He's gonna be getting lots of shots today. And this dude over here, that's Adam, who was nice enough to pick us up at the airport and take us right to the stadium. Game time is like 23 minutes from now. So I gotta get my backpack in order, get my head in order. We're gonna be heading inside any second, just looking for a parking spot. So let's do this. Oh yeah, life is hard. <laughs> Beer's cheaper in Texas, right? April 15th, Jackie Robinson Day. This, of course, is the date when Jackie first debuted in the major leagues and broke the color barrier way back in 1947. So everybody on both teams is wearing number 42, including my boy Mike Trout out there on second base doing Mike Trout things, working the count full, drawing a walk. Of course, I had hoped that he would blast one to dead center field and I could run out on the hill and catch it. No such luck. So I am going back and forth from center field to the third base dugout. I'm probably going to run about five miles inside the stadium today, and I hope it pays off. Another full count for Trouty. The man does everything. Everything. Thank you. All right, sure thing. Oh, look at this. That's pretty awesome. You're very welcome. You got one today? I have zero baseballs today. I have to get one to keep my streak alive. Who 
total. Thanks, buddy. Absolutely. Um, all right. He's off. Time to give this third out ball thing another shot. Whew. How you doing? How's it going? Don't talk to me right now. Oh, I mean that lovingly, but like, oh, another relaxing day at the ballpark. Oh. Continues. Uh, Look at this thing. I am so happy right now. O M G. Kept the streak alive and got a commemorative ball. Final season of Globe Life Park, and it's a pristine logo too, which might not seem like it would even be a thing to worry about. Like you got the ball, what's the big deal? But you know, a, a guy could hit his bat on the part of the ball at the logo and it could smudge, or he could chop one in the dirt and it could get scuffed. So, this one is as good as it gets. It's flawless. And, uh, you know, I'm gonna be here the next couple days. I'm gonna be back in May, I think, and maybe for the final game. I don't even know. So I'll have plenty of chances throughout the season to be here and get this ball. But to get it on the first night and wrap it up early, and now I can really just stay in the outfield and focus on getting home run balls. I already missed one earlier, Shin Su Chu. I called it. My videographer, Ian, and Adam, who's sitting right there, will confirm in the car to the stadium. I said, I know it's going to happen. I'm going to be in foul territory, and someone's going to hit a home run onto the berm. And it happened. It was on the far end of the berm, so maybe like 100 feet away. It would have been a long run, but it had so much air time. I feel like if I wouldn't have caught it on the fly, I would have grabbed that off the grass. So I still have two and a half games out here for some home run magic. We'll see if it happens. A couple more things. First of all, I have no idea who threw me that ball. Maybe Zach Cozart, but they're all wearing 42. Can't tell them apart. That was the ball that ended the fourth inning. Right now, it is the bottom of the fifth. It's a slugfest. Rangers are winning five to four. There've been three home runs. And guys, don't give me any crap about using a fork to eat this sandwich. I'm trying to keep this hand clean to handle my precious baseball and my left hand clean to go in the baseball glove. Okay, thank you. Top seven, Trout just led off with a four-pitch walk. I mean, why am I sitting out here if they're not going to pitch to him? So the Rangers have put up some crooked numbers. It's 11 to four now. What's going on? 
I want to see more bombs from the Angels. I want extra innings. And then I want to catch a walk-off. All right, we're in the top of the ninth inning right now. Albert Pujols is up. I'm heading to the dugout to try to catch Mike Trout, but I'm waiting here in case he jacks one, and it's a ground out to the third baseman. Let's go. Really cool to get up close to the action to close this game out. Seeing batters from 15 feet away in the on-deck circle, Mike Trout lurking in the dugout, all the Angels players hanging out on the top step, and an instant replay review to end it. The final call on the field stood, the umpires made the out gesture, and it was a final. 12 to seven, the Rangers won it. A slugfest, like I said, with five home runs. Now as for me, taking you back to the beginning. My flight was delayed, I missed batting practice, I was running all over the place, getting completely stressed out. I thought my streak was gonna end, but I got the ball that ended the fourth inning, a third out ball tossed up, and then after the game, home plate umpire Greg Gibson hooked it up for me. So two baseballs today, you can see them right here, both commemorative, so that brings my lifetime total to 10,699, and I am gonna give away one of these commemorative balls as a prize on Instagram. So what you gotta do is look for the post where I show this ball, all right? Then you gotta make sure that you're following me, you gotta like the post, and leave a comment in which you tag at least two other people that you personally know, and I will select someone at random. So good luck, it might be you. Now as you can see, this place is totally empty. I gotta get out of here. I will be back tomorrow, and I will be here on time. So hopefully there'll be a full batting practice, lots of action, home runs, running out on the berm. Stay tuned for that one, and thanks for watching this.